The Desmond and Leah Tutu Legacy Foundation has its home in Cape Town, South Africa. For many years, Desmond Tutu has stood on the side of those who suffer, and he has suffered much, but has always believed that evil will never have the last word, that not even a virus can separate us from each other, that we ought to continue to speak truth to power, and that forgiveness is more powerful than revenge. This year, as he turns 90 years old, his official foundation has launched the 90 at 90 campaign to ensure that his work, wisdom, and legacy are sustained. The campaign aims to raise 90 million rand, or at least 6 million US dollars. We thank our creator for Desmond Tutu's insights, for his life and witness, and thank you for honoring it in this way. I'm heartened by the Arch and by his continued resolve to lead by example through his foundation and through the newly unveiled Tutu Legacy Fund. He's inspired us all. He's given his all in pursuit of this inspiring mission. His message and his voice still ring clear after all these years. After everything, he remains joyful and hopeful. As he turns 90, the time has come to hand over this rich legacy over to you who give us hope, such as Engam Fundisi, Andrea Vedeman, Kurt Hartley, Ayaka Melitafa, and Akona Koye. I pay tribute to you, Dada. Your legacy will live on through each and every one of us. As part of the youth of South Africa, I'm proud of the struggles that you have fought for this and many other nations. Be assured that we will take the baton you have given us and run with it. We love you and we thank you for serving as a beacon of hope and an inspiration to me. They work for climate justice and equality. They work for women's equality. They are showing the way. Now is the time for global justice. Now is the time for Anubuntu that includes all. Kinako, the time has come. Will you support the 1990 Tutu Legacy campaign? I am because you are. My success and my failures are bound up in yours.